guys today is June 28th right now it's about 7 a.m. in the morning I am planning on going to Payne's Prairie with one of my friends Kylie um, so that's why I'm up super early because we wanted to go and it wasn't too hot out yet so I'm gonna go make a yogurt parfait and some mint tea to wake myself up So I'm getting ready to head out the door, but before I do, I wanted to show you everything I'm bringing because these are all the essentials that you should have with you. First things first, it costs $6 to get into Payne's Prairie if you're going in a car. So it's $6 for the entire car, even if it's packed full. So my friend Kylie and I are splitting that cost three and three. So first thing, I have my money with me so that we can get in. Secondly, I'm bringing some sunglasses because it is a bright sunny day here in Florida, not raining for once. Another essential that I'm bringing is my water bottle. Since it is sunny, it's hot, and I'm going to be sweating, and I really don't want to be dehydrated, so I need to keep hydrating myself with water. And then another thing I'm bringing is one of these insect repellent bands that you can put on your wrist or ankle. I'm very prone to getting bit by mosquitoes and Payne's Prairie has a lot of those so bringing this you could also just bring bug spray but personally I don't like the smell of that and this gets the job done so I just use this and then the last thing debatably the most important don't forget your apartment key so that you can lock your apartment up I mean me I can't really lock myself out because of this special key we have but anyways and then your car keys so that you can actually drive there um those are all the essentials that i'm bringing with me right now i'm getting ready to head over to pick up kylie i'm super excited i haven't seen her in a while so this will be fun and i'm excited to be outside and explore Payne's prairie a little bit more because i've only been there once before there's a lot of things to do there's so many trails they have an observation tower which i really want to go to today just to like check it out but yes, I will take you guys along and I'll catch up with you either when I pick up Kylie or probably when we get to Payne's Prairie. <laughs> okay, we're at Payne's Prairie. We're getting ready to go to the observation tower. This is Kylie. So there's 27 buffalo out there. It looks really cool. So we just got finished walking around Payne's Prairie and now we're gonna walk downtown for a little bit. I just saw a really cool wall that was painted all nice and pretty blue with an octopus, so I'll insert a clip of that. I thought it was really interesting. Um, and yeah, I've never really been downtown here in Gainesville, even though I've been here for two years, so this will be fun. I'm excited to explore and see some new things and see places that I might wanna go in the future, so.
Hey guys, I just got back from hanging out with Kylie. It was so nice to catch up with her. I wish we could have done it a little bit more over the summer, but our schedules just haven't really lined up. But so glad I got to hang out with her today. Walking around Payne's Prairie and downtown Gainesville was awesome. Getting to experience a few different places around Gainesville. We went to a coffee shop. The coffee was really good. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm back at my apartment now. I think I'm gonna hop into the shower because I feel gross. And when I get out, I'm thinking I'm gonna take a nap because I have a bit of a headache and I just don't wanna have a headache when I go to work later. So shower, nap, and then I'll eat some food for lunch. All right, just got out of the shower. I feel so much better, so clean. Um, now I'm gonna lie down and take like a 20 minute nap just to hope that this headache goes away and when I wake up I'll go and make some lunch probably watch a show while I eat lunch but yeah it's nap time now got my fan on ready to lie down for a little bit 20 minutes later I just woke up from my nap that was very much needed I feel so much better my hair is still very wet, but I don't have a blow dryer here and I hate blow drying my hair, so it's just gonna have to air dry. Hopefully it's dry by the time I get to work, but I did change into my work clothes. So for work today, I just decided to throw on this t-shirt for our summer camp and some black shorts. Just like a standard look for work. Um, shoes. I don't know, I'll probably just throw on flip flops. I'm about to go make some lunch because I'm super hungry, so let's go do that. So for lunch, I just decided to make a sandwich with some hummus and different types of vegetables on it, some cheese, and I put a little bit of lemon juice on it, and I'm going to have that with some bell pepper and some hummus on the side. So I'm going to eat my lunch now while I watch an episode of Psych. Um, which was recommended to me by Alex. We've watched a couple episodes together and I've been watching it this past week while he's been on while he's been on vacation. So I'm gonna enjoy that, enjoy my food. Then after I eat, I'll catch back up with you guys and I'll continue getting ready for work. I just finished lunch. It was so good. I was so hungry. <laughs> Um, now it's time to finish getting ready for work, so I'm just going to brush my hair, brush my teeth, put on deodorant, pack my backpack to put my computer in there, because I do a little bit of work on my computer when I first get there. And then, yeah, it should be a very good work day today. So before I go to work, I just wanted to pop on here and just talk to you guys about making sure that you're spending time with your friends and family. I mean, yeah, a lot of us over the summer, especially in college, have a lot of things going on. You're doing internships, you have a job, you might be shadowing, or you might be studying abroad, getting some other life experiences in, traveling. But it is important to make sure that you're setting time aside to spend with your friends and your family. I have seen my family a few times and seeing Kylie today just really gave me that desire to meet up and catch up with people that I haven't seen in such a long time. So if you're watching this and we haven't talked in a long time, find me. Alright guys, I am getting in my car to head off to work now. Um, this is going to be a little bit of a struggle to do this with a phone. But, yes, it is around 3.30. It takes me about half an hour to get there. Um, and I start work at 4, so I think... Probably won't talk to you guys until after I get off of work at 8.30. So, I will see you guys then... It's gonna be a good work day, I'm telling you now. I just got out of work and I'm getting ready to head back home, so I will catch you guys when I'm back because obviously I'm not gonna vlog and drive at the same time, so. Um, work went really well. It wasn't even that long. It just seemed kinda of long today, I guess, because I really didn't get out onto the floor too much to coach. We had a few, too many coaches and not enough kids show up today, so. Um, but I did get a lot of stuff done, so. 
I'm excited to go home and shower and go to bed. <laughs> so I just got back from work and I'm gonna FaceTime my parents for the night and then once I'm done with that, I'll go into the kitchen and make a smoothie. So I actually just ended up showering after I FaceTimed my parents just because it was getting late and I wanted to get that over with. So now I'm finally enjoying my leftover smoothie from yesterday and I'm going to enjoy this while I watch a YouTube video, then I'll brush my teeth and go to bed. So I wanted to come on and end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this little day in my life summer edition, I guess. <laughs> Um, I do work every day going to Payne's Prairie and walking around downtown Gainesville is definitely not a daily occurrence, but today was just catching up with an old friend and having a good time, so I'm glad I got to bring you guys along with me, and you guys finally got to meet Kylie, <laughs> so yeah, hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in my or our next video on the B&O Vlogs. Bye guys! We're having some hair problems today. Just walking around the like gymnastics. La, 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 I can't talk. Gymnastics equipment, but. Oh, you, you vlog with your phone? <laughs> Wait, can I have my hair? I don't have on? a camera. I don't have a cool camera. Good thing How do you wild feel wings about that? Here. Huh? It's a good thing Buffalo Wild Wings isn't here. <laughs> <laughs> There'll be uh, wait, wait, 27 what? less Buffalo.